More than 100 Haitian migrants now being questioned. You see them there. They're being processed as well by Border Patrol after they came ashore in the Florida Keys. CBS 4's Deborah Souverine is live in Dania Beach with more on this and why exactly this keeps happening. Well, Candice, since the assassination of President Jovenel Moise last July, Haiti has fallen deeper into political and economic turmoil. Now, yesterday, more than 100 migrants made it ashore. Some of them are being held here in Dania Beach at the Customs and Border Patrol facility here, where they'll be processed. Buses filled with migrants from Haiti headed to customs in a border patrol station. It is horrible. The, it is a country at war. Community leader Marlene Bastien describing the horrific conditions in Haiti that she says prompted the migrants to attempt coming into the country. When we see our brothers and sisters risking their lives on rickety boats to make it to the land of the free, uh, we know that the situation, you know, is worsening in Haiti. And Bastien says the situation is especially dire for women and children. The past few months, women and girls have suffered uh, tremendously. When they are kidnapped, they are gang raped and killed. Even um, regular merchants, regular people are not safe. Monday, a boat of about 120 migrants attempted to leave the chaos behind. The sailboat arrived in a residential community in Summerland Key, about 20 miles north of Key West in front of mansions that lined the beach. When the boat ran aground, they started making their way to the shore. Everybody arrived fairly healthy. There were four subjects that needed to be transported to the hospital. We provided them medical care immediately. The rest of the Haitian non-citizens that arrived today are in good condition. This is the third large group of Haitian migrants to arrive in South Florida in less than a month. Officials say the group will be processed and interviewed at Custom and Border Protection facilities. And Bastien says if history has any indication of what happens next, that group will eventually be deported. And it is unacceptable that the U.S. is sending them back without due process because 356 came on last Sunday, a week ago, and then 200 were, were sent back. Uh, on Thursday in complete violations of their basic rights of due process. These are bona fide refugees. Uh, they deserve to be heard. Now, this is the second time in two weeks that a large group of Haitian migrants came to shore in the Florida Keys. Now, officials tell us that it's not clear if this ship came directly from Haiti or elsewhere in the Caribbean. We're live in Dania Beach. I'm Deborah Souverine, CBS4 This Morning.